All right, it's time to delve a little bit deeper into the world of horror, this time with Mannequin House. I have no idea what to expect with this, so we're just going to jump right into it, shall we? All right. 9.59 p.m. Okay. Oh. This is so green. It's very, very green. Not sure how I feel about that. Wow, these are some shiny floors. Oh my god. Okay. Um. That one's locked. What do we got over here? Oh, nice waterfall. Oh, lights don't do anything. Okay, what about you? Can I go in here? No? Um. I'll let me get into this one. Uh, I am apparently a floating ball of light. Interesting. I don't think there's anything else going on in there. Um. Fuck. Can't interact with that. Fuck. Man, there's a whole lot of locked doors in this place. Why are you living in a house with so many locked doors? I don't understand. Like, none of my interior doors are locked like this. Okay. Um. We'll go very, very jankily back up the stairs. Check this door. Yeah, it's locked, of course. Alright, um. This isn't where I left my bed. Uh. Okay, um. Okay, but why though? I just want to go back to bed. Eh. Oh, hello. Finally, a door that isn't locked. What do you got for me? Ooh, that looks like a comfy couch. What do we got over here? The Daily News, breaking news. Um, America, I guess. Is there anything I can do in here? Um, can't open any drawers. Can't do really much of it. Why would why'd you lead me in here? Is this something? No. No. Um, what do we got over here? You unlocked yet? Nope. All right, well, let's go back upstairs. I apparently have a very hard time walking up the stairs. So, yep, still locked. Okay. Well, no. And we go again. And behind door number two, the same hallway. <laughs> nope. Hey, oh wait, no, this is just the bathroom again. Uh, eh, we're back here. Am I missing something? Because I feel like I'm missing something. There is someone else here. There's more than one set of footsteps going on in this place. And you're locked. Alright, now we struggle to go back up the stairs again. Nope. That's different. I'm glad something new is happening. Okay. Uh, yep, door closes. Still locked. 
Oh, the lights are off in here now. Interesting. Very, very interesting. At least something's happening. I don't... Uh... Hi! I'm gonna go this way. If it'll let me go this way. I don't know if it's gonna let me. Okay, guess we're not going that way. Uh... Alright. Into... Into the darkness we go. This is some, like, advanced darkness we got going on over here. Uh, okay. Oh. Struggle back up the stairs again. And... Wait. Oh, okay. No? No shenanigans from you this time? So, wait, I'm not entirely sure what I should be doing. Do I just keep... Hello? Something's happening. Hi. So it's slightly different each time. So, I know this is supposed to be something about a game that loops and then changes and you have to figure out how to break the loop or something like that. But, uh, I'm not entirely sure how that's going to work. I feel like I may have seen gameplay on this before, uh, at some point in the past, and... But I'm not really, I'm not really too sure. Well, that was convenient timing. Hello? Oh, I go back this way. Well, that's different. I cannot see anything, despite the fact I'm apparently a glowing ball of light. Hello, hello. What do we have here? Aha! Now I can see where I'm going. The game read my mind. All right. Starting to get a little bit, uh, a little bit spicy. Oh boy! Back downstairs. Anything new down here? Hello? Demons? Nope. Locked. Locked. Uh, okay, lock. Okay. So do I go back upstairs again, then? Seems like the best idea. Just being thrown into the dark is so disorienting. Like, this map is really small, and I'm forgetting where I'm going just because the lights are off now. So, uh, GG on that one, I guess. Okay. This is where I got the flashlight from, correct? Yes. Let's go... Back down the hallway. Did it close? There it goes. Okay. I'm gonna check every time I hear a door close, just to make sure nothing tries to sneak up on me. I know there's something moving around in here. Like, we already saw the one mannequin. Uh, locked. I'm starting to think that this game has a very, just, um, linear thing. That, like a linear path that I have to follow and events will happen as they need to happen. For me trying to deviate is just not going to get me anywhere. Hello? Hello? Nothing. Okay, uh, back downstairs. I must. I, I definitely missed something. Because everything is locked up now. Where am I going? What am I doing? Uh. Ah, there. 
Hey now, I was enjoying that red light. Ooh, what are you? That is the... Yeah, that, that's just the, the golden arm. Um, get my flashlight back, please. Arms for everybody. And heads and all sorts of stuff. Well, see where it gets its name from. The, uh, the mannequin house. These are all mannequin pieces. Okay. I don't know why I keep trying to open cabinets and drawers and stuff. I have already established that they don't they don't have anything in them. Alright. Uh, do we go back upstairs now? Yes, yes we do. Alright. What do you got for me now? Uh, anything at all? Just locked. Oh. Hello, friend. I don't remember you being there. What you looking at? Yes, that's a uh, it's a very nice road. Some trees. Oh, you brought friends. Hello. What do we got over here? We got uh, maybe a sunrise or a sunset. No, pretty picture. You're just... Well, I was going to say, you're just creepy, and then you had to go and do that. Ah! Whoa. Um. Hello? Where'd your head go? Where did all of your heads go? One of you is missing. Got a head thief running around. Can you imagine living in a world of mannequins and there's just one like psychopathic mannequin running around popping everybody else's heads off and running off of them? Would that be like scary to them or would it be comical like when C-3PO lost his head in one of the Star Wars prequels and they tried to make it funny and then just it really wasn't all that funny. Well, uh, nope. we on our next loop. Yep, here we go. What you got for me this time? Hi! I see you found your heads. Good to, uh, good to see you're all, all attacked again. Weird. Uh-oh. Hello? Um. I can't seem to go that way. Keep getting that one. Oh, maybe I go here. Bathroom. Hmm. I didn't know I could do that. I take a bath. You know, all things considered, it would probably relieve a whole lot of stress for me right now. Taking a nice... Oh, right, yeah. Taking a nice hot bath with all of this shit going on. Seems like a pretty good idea to me. And you've all moved again. Okay. Well, I guess I'm not going that way. So... Back up we go. On to the next loop. Find all the missing mannequin parts. Do I have to? Like, is that really necessary? Anything in here? Can I just steal your parts? No. Hello? Hi! I feel like that would have been a little creepier if I was actually looking at you when that happened. But, uh, I wasn't, so... Sorry I ruined your jump scare on that one. That's that's my bad. Alright, well, there was no parts in there. So... What are you, gonna steal your parts? No. Okay. 
What are you gesturing at? It's a wall. Oh. Oh my god. Can I go in here? I know there was that one room that had all those mannequin parts inside of it. Is that where I'm supposed to be going? Oh, hey. I found an arm. Hey, how are ya? You just, uh, you just stay right there. I'm gonna go this way. Oh, the heads actually follow you. Yeah, that, I don't, I don't like that. So I did, I checked the bathroom, right? Was that for this loop? Oh, I am so sorry. Um, I will just excuse myself. My bad. I should have knocked first. Okay. Um, hug me. Alright, well, I guess I have to do something over here still, though. Because they won't let me go. Oh, there we go. Okay. So now we got a head. How many parts did I need to find? I don't actually remember. Oh, I am so good at games. I am not, however, good at climbing stairs. Okay. Um. Uh, is this. No, oh, no, you're the one that's just standing in the corner staring at me. I'll just lead you to whatever it is that you're doing. Okay, so it goes back automatically. Alright, I thought I had to come back up here and actually put them there myself. So I need to find one more arm. I'm sure I could just break it off from that one. Make my life so much easier. Can't go that way. You're still gesturing at a wall. Oh. Didn't see this door before. Oh, hey, this is the room I was talking about. The one that had all the... Why are you bleeding? You don't do the bleed. Stop sniffling at me. It's weird. Alright, yes, I know. I go this way. Yeah. This way. Ah. Uh, 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 uh. oh. Like, it's almost a shame that I don't get jump scared super easily. Like, they are getting me. And they just give me ridiculous cold chills whenever it happens. Alright, well, path's cleared again. Like, they're gonna have to get me really, really good. Really, really good if, uh, you're gonna get any kind of, like, a scream or a shout or a noticeable jump from me. Which is... kind of what's drawn me to these. I want to see if there's actually a game out there that can legitimately scare me. That's it's kind of the challenge I've set for myself, is to find something scary. And so far, none of these games have really done much in terms of a uh, massive scare. Okay. We go back this way. We go back upstairs. Haha, -ha, you don't have a head. You can't stare at me now. Fucking mannequins. Okay. Um. Oh boy. Oh no. Um. I thought I was stuck there for a second. What do we got? A never-ending hallway? Something gonna come screaming out at me? Oh, well, I found all their heads. Anybody feel up for a game of soccer? Or football, if you are so inclined? And not a filthy American like myself? There's a door. Music is picking up a little. Okay. And we're back here. Uh, is that it? Did I miss something? 
There's no way that was it. Um, alright, so I guess that was it then. Okay. Well, that was interesting. Not quite as spooky as I was hoping it was going to be. Got a couple uh, good scares out of me. Again, I apologize for me not being the most animated person with being scared. But it definitely got me a couple times. Kept me on edge a little bit when things, when the flashlight had to be used and threw me off. It was a little disorienting, but yeah, it was alright. It was fun. I enjoyed myself. But uh, let me know what you thought. Is it scary? Is it not? Let me know. Leave a comment. Maybe subscribe. But I will talk to you all next time.